Welcome to Platinum Skincare Care Spa. Today we're going to be performing a glycolic acid chemical peel. Most people know what a glycolic peel is. It's probably the most common acid used because it's great for everybody. Follow me and I'll show you how it's done. Okay, to begin the glycolic peel process, we're going to start by thoroughly cleansing the client's skin. Okay, the client's skin has been cleansed and now we're going to apply our Prep A solution to defat the skin. Once that's air dried, we'll begin with our peel. A series of six to eight treatments is the best way to administer a glycolic peel in order to get the best results. You can pour a small amount of the solution into a cup. Now we can fold a gauze pad in half and dip that into the solution. Just wipe any excess off so it doesn't drip. Now we're going to apply this to the client's face. Generally you'll work from the outside in. As you start to apply the acid, that's when you're going to want to set your timer. We're going to time this peel for five minutes. Okay, at this point we're going to watch the skin uh, for any signs of redness. If there are any areas that are too irritating to the client, you can dab and neutralize that area. Now we don't know if she's going to get pink or not. She might get a little bit. I see a little bit there on the cheek area. Are you feeling anything now or no? You can turn the fan on at this point. Is it still tingly? That's great. Okay. Because sometimes if the peel starts to neutralize by your skin's natural pH levels, we can add a little bit more on to kind of bump the pH level down again. Do you think I'm getting used to it now because I've been doing it? It is possible, and then we could move up to the next percentage. Right.
<laughs> Got about a minute and a half left. TCAs are great. You're going to get a lot more peeling with the TCA though, so you got to be prepared for that. Oh, there's our five minutes. Yeah, TCA is super duper for collagen stimulation. You know, that's what I want. You know, we talked about the benefit of the collagen production, hopefully. You will with the glycolic, anyways, as long as you're using at least a 30% glycolic acid or any alpha hydroxy acids, they will help to stimulate collagen production in the skin. We're at our five minute mark, so now we're going to neutralize our glycolic acid. We're gonna use Platinum Skin Care Neutralizer. When you first apply a neutralizer, there might be a little bit of an intense irritation, kind of like when you were first applying the peel that will go away in just a moment. Once we have applied the neutralizer and neutralized the acid, we can go ahead and cool the client's skin with some nice ice water. We'll just apply that until she no longer has any irritation. Let her know when that feels nice and cool, and then we'll go ahead and just apply some emo oil for hydrating and antibacterial purposes. And the client can leave with this on their face. We suggest they use this daily after a chemical peel for healing. We see a little bit of eurythma, which is a slight pinkness to the skin on her cheek area. She's felt a little discomfort on her forehead and it is slightly pink. Now that the ointment's on, this will conclude our glycolic peel procedure. How do you feel? Fine. Good. <laughs> no more burning or anything like that, right? No.